Hi, I'm going to show you how to turn your Vistaprint website into a Vistaprint store with the Shop Integrator shopping cart and e-commerce button add-ins. Uh, so it's very quick and easy to do. And here I have a, an end page that I've created here. I'm going to show you just how quick it was to create that. So as you can see, when I click on the Buy Now button, it opens the shopping cart. It's my um, charming pink flower bracelet could just as easily be a digital download product like an ebook or an audio track um, it's connected to PayPal uh, however there are other supported payment processes available so um, by empty that cart now close the cart and I'm going to close the the demo uh, preview page and that was the page we were just previewing so what I'm going to do is I'm going to create a blank page now to show you just how I created that and how I inserted my e-commerce buttons to do that so we're going to add a um, a store page. We're going to make that a blank page. I'm going to call it store. And here we have our new page. I'm going to click done. Okay, so it's a blank page. And I'm going to put a few carriage turns in there. Okay, so. I'm going to start off by inserting a, a table so I can divide this into to two two blocks. And I'm going to have two columns and just the one row, but you can have multiple rows for multiple products. I'm going to turn off the background color and the borders just so I've got two holders now. Here I'm going to put the image and here I'm going to put my e-commerce buy now button. Okay, so I already have the um, the image uh, that I'd uploaded for the for that bracelet, so I'm going to choose that. Just going to shrink that down, so it takes up about half the page. Okay, so now we want the buy now button. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to my shop integrator web admin, and this is the web admin dashboard. So this add e-commerce to your website or a shortcut button to it here. Um, it's going to take me to the the simple steps to follow to um, add the e-commerce buttons in. Now I've already created a product using the product manager. Um, so this step one, I'm going to choose the Vistaprint. Once I've done this once, that's going to stay as a setting now um, going forward. So the sell single product, this is going to be the, the, the standalone e-commerce buttons I got to cart and buy now for that particular product. Sell multiple products, will give me lists of products um, all together, like a table of product e-commerce buttons for multiple products. Check out and currency controls, so they check out and view cart buttons, shopper basket information, uh, such as the total number of items in the cart or total cost of the cart. So here I pick my product stock code, so it's already chosen uh, as bracelet, which is the one I want. Now the add to cart um, will add the item to the cart, but not open the checkout. So the one we had in that that demo I've shown you was the buy now. So I'm going to use this button. So now it's going to put this e-commerce add in into my page. So the price quantity to select the buy now button and um, a short description. You want to change the look of that, the font, the layout, the buttons, you do that with your appearance manager here. But I'm going to keep it as, as is for now um, as this tutorial is about adding the e-commerce to the Vistaprint website. So here I'm going to part one um, of this final step is to copy and paste this master shop script in. So I go back in, I'm going to click at the bottom. So this uh, this isn't going to do anything on its own. This just will allow the other e-commerce buttons in this page to work. So I'm just going to use the extras and I'm going to scroll down to the handy HTML widget and I'm going to paste that in the page. So on its own this block uh, is invisible it, but will take up a little bit of space which is why I put it at the bottom so that it doesn't, um, doesn't show anything. So that now will allow the part two button text. So we go back to the Shop Integrator Web Admin. So this part two text, copy and paste the e-commerce plugin into your web page. We'll put this buy now button we just chose above. So I copy that. I'm going to again use the extras handy HTML widget to scroll down and paste that in. And now, so here we have. Uh, I'm going to save that now. 
I'm going to preview this now it's not going to properly show me the button it's going to be cropped I know that but I just wanted to show you what that means and what it looks like and then I'm going to show you how uh, to sort that out so here now we see um, we see only part of the e-commerce button add-in that we wanted so it should look like this however what we're seeing is just a, a chunk of it so um, it's it's basically cropped uh, and what we're going to do is we can close the preview and it's because Vistaprint uh, by default creates this long thin rectangular box and that's like a frame, that's a window onto the content behind so even if the content is bigger that frame um, it will crop the content so that you can only see the, the width of that frame so we know that content is bigger so I'm just going to grab the end of it, click on those box and just make that um, bigger to so give enough area for that all of that e-commerce button to show in uh, on the page and so obviously I can adjust, adjust that and shrink it and make it bigger as necessary um, to see what's right so let's just save that and now when I preview the page you'll see because that that um, box is uh, larger around the e-commerce button that it now shows the whole of the content properly and uh, here we've got our nice um, pink charm bracelet and here a fully functioning um, shopping cart to allow someone to buy that product so it's connected to PayPal um, it connects to other payment processes uh, very simply so what I'm going to do is I'm going to close that cart now now in the demo we had a view cart and a checkout button here so if you had multiple products and maybe you're using the ad add to cart buttons or the shopper wanted to, to go on and buy other products from you um, so I'm going to show you how to add those now so we close the Vistaprint demo page and I'm going to put it up here so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to put a few carriage turns to create a little bit of space there um, and back in my shop integrator web admin scroll up to this this step 2 what type of e-commerce button plugin do we want to add and it's now the checkout and currency controls so I click on that it's going to um, choose that set of e-commerce button add-ins and we're going to want the view cart so that's the first one in the list so that's already chosen so let's scroll down we already have this in our page uh, so we don't need to put that again so it's this part 2 button script that we want so I'm going to copy that and again I'm going to go into my extras and in the Vistaprint site builder I'm going to scroll down to the handy HTML widget and when I click on that I'm going to paste that in. Now I'm not going to close that because I want the two buttons side by side um, so actually I'm going to put two buttons in here together in, in the same um, handy HTML widget so when I go back to my web admin and I scroll up but now I want this checkout button so we're going to use this one instead so now that one's chosen when I scroll down take the part 2 script and copy that I'm going to put that here I'm going to click done and uh, now when I save the page I go back to the preview and the site opens here you'll see the um, e-commerce product I've created and the view cart and checkout button so I still have the the, uh, the shopping cart from before that I added that to so when I view the cart um, I'm going to have two of those here's my product continue checkout and here we are so uh, that demo showed you how to use the shop integrator shopping cart to add e-commerce buttons and a functioning checkout into your Vistaprint website using the handy HTML widget. So um, thanks for watching and uh, good luck with your online store in Vistaprint.